Hi, Terry Van Noy. Welcome to Math Class with Terry V. Hope this video helps you out, and if you enjoy it, please share it, comment, or like it. And you can also go to my website, mathpowerline.com. It's a math resource blog, uh, lesson videos for students, and other resources for parents and teachers. Give me a call, or go to my website or email. All right, let's go to today's lesson. All right, here's my question. The sale price of an appliance is $500 after a 25% discount. What was the original price? So obviously the sale price is mentioned as $500. Okay, the discount amount, we don't know. The original price is what we're asking for, okay? Now, when you look at the original price, that's 100%, okay? When you go into the store and you pay the original price as asked on this tag, you pay 100% of the price, okay? But the discount is supposed to be 25%, right? That means that the $500 represents what's left, which has got to be 75%. So it's this information right here that we have to put into some kind of form where we can solve and find out the original price. Okay, this is a typical discount question where there's a missing step, okay? They talk about a 25% discount, but what you have to do is translate that in your head and say, well, that means I'm paying 75% of what's left, okay? The sale price represents 75% of the whole original price, okay? That's the missing step. So you need to make sure that you subtract and you use 75% in the way you work this problem and not 25. So now the next step is to take this information and solve it as either a word problem which I'll translate into an equation or a proportion which I'll show you over here in just a second. I teach two different methods. You choose whichever method makes the most sense for you. Alright, 75% of what original amount is $500? That's really what we're being asked. All right, now when I translate into an equation, remember that 75% becomes 0.75 of, always means multiplication in these kinds of questions, x is some kind of unknown I'm solving for, is would be the equal sign, and 500. All right, so how do I solve this? Well, what I'm going to need to do is figure out what I'm doing to each side. Here I'm multiplying the x by 0.75, so to undo that I divide by 0.75. Okay, multiplication means I have to undo it with division. So, turns out in one step I can get my answer and I would divide 500 by 0.75. The answer is $666 and repeating sixes that go forever, so I'm gonna round it to 67 cents, okay? So that's the original price. I would take a 25% discount off of that, subtract, and end up with the sale price of $500, okay? That's the equation method. The proportion method over here on the right, okay? I always set up my proportion the same way. 100% goes down in the lower left. The percent, if I know it, goes in the upper uh, upper left, and in this case it's 75 percent. Now the is number, which is the part, and the of number is the whole amount. Okay, do I know the whole amount? No. Of what? Okay, so the of part is unknown. Alright, the original price. Okay, the is, five hundred dollars is the part that represents 75 percent. Okay, so is over of, that's a quick little word trick there to remember. Okay, the part over the whole. 75% is the part, the whole is 100%. Now in this case, of course, I'm going to multiply. So I'm going to get 0.75x, cross multiply there, and 500 times 100% is going to be 500. Okay, notice that the mathematics is actually the same. I'm going to divide each side by 0.75 and I would get the same answer. Okay, I'm just going to draw an arrow right there and say I'm done. Alright, so here's the bottom line. 
when you're given a discount question, remember the discount is the part that gets taken off the original price. So the remaining part would be 75% in this case, and you work with that number in either an equation or a proportion. All right, there you have it. I invite you to go to my website now, mathpowerline.com, or email me or give me a call. The way I work best with students is live online in my classroom. So if I can help you in any way, answer some specific questions, the first lesson with me is free as I show you how everything works. All right, study hard and take care.